Hey everyone, Tech no Manager here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to enable deep effect on your Samsung One UI 7. So let's get started. First thing is go to the App Store and to search bar here, you're going to search up Good Lock. So we'll search for Good Lock. And then you're going to install this Good Lock, which is from Samsung. So we're going to go ahead and install that app. So once it has been installed, you're going to exit out then find that app we're going to go ahead and find that app and open it up and once you open up the good lock app which we're going to have to hit and agree you're going to look for basically lock start and install it so here i have it installed already but if you didn't you click on that install icon and download the lock star now with that installed the next thing you're going to do is go to your gallery and then use a photo that you like to use. So I'm going to go ahead and search a photo. For example, I want this photo, right? So what you'll do is first long press and hold, right, the photo, and then save. Basically, you'll save it as image. Save as image. Now that it's been saved as a new image, we're ready to go. So we'll go ahead and exit out of that. And this time, we're going to go into our setting. And then from our settings here, we're going to find wallpaper and styles. So you can click on it. And what you're going to do is change the wallpaper. So pick a wallpaper that you want as the default background first. So for example, if you want this wallpaper, and hit next. And then what do you do this is you'll see this lock star that we just installed using the good lock. We're going to tap on that and then add app widget. And then from here on, we're going to select gallery, right? and then tap here to add a widget. Now we have a widget and it might ask you to give it access. Make sure you give it access and there on you're going to move this around. So let's go ahead and tap here. I'm going to go ahead and click on that gear icon right here and then select image and this image that I have just saved as an image. I'm going to hit done and now I have that image and then I move that around. And then what you do is basically lay this over just like that, wherever you want it. You can move it around and hit done. And now the changes have been applied, right? So you'll see here. And then if I lock the phone, I can see that deep effect. Now, depending on the image, this is a bad example. But if you had a nice image with the background and it's properly cropped and such, you can get that deep effect just like that. So that's how you can do it. I hope this video was helpful. So please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks. See you guys next time.